for my next research analysis to include in my annotated bibliography, I'm going to carry on with this same idea of the stem cell debate. And am I looking at this stem cell debate from an ethical question or from a safety perspective? If it's ethical, then I can go through that whole thing. But if it's if it's a matter of dangers and what's what is uh, possible to do, I want to make sure that I have for my foundation a vetted interview with somebody who is informative. A little six minute thing with somebody is not going to be the cornerstone of my essay that I want to include in the annotated bibliography. Maybe I'll use this later on and I'll add that to my bibliography, my works cited page later on. But for now, for the annotated bibliography, I want to show my main force, my main sources. So now as we know with anything scientific, any tutorials, any information that is older than two years old is never going to work. Science moves way too fast for that. But I'm going to go with this one and I'm going to find out about this guy later on. But for the crux of what I'm what I'm writing about. This is two years ago, so it's good enough to use for this. Now I know you already did this in week four when you were exploring all of the avenues of your topic. So I'm just showing you how I'm going to create this crux of my uh, analysis in an annotated bibliography. So I'm going to click on him. I'm going to have to do this citation manually using EasyBib. And I'm going to need the URL, the title, contributor, TEDx. So let's go over to EasyBib and see what we need to do. Okay, so I've come in here to complete this citation. Let me show you how I got here real quick. Back in my project, I went to create a citation. It's not a website. YouTube won't show up. Journal, book. So I'm going to go here, film an online video. And I'm just going to enter it manually because I've already been down this route. I know it'll just take forever. So I'm just going to fill in the blanks. So over here at the, the video that I'm going to use, I'm going to copy the title. Back over here, fill in the title. And I'm going to see if I can find the contributors over here. That's it, TED Talks. So I put down the director, it's TEDx Talks. Now we've got the name of the person who is offering the information. And instead of director, this is the performer. And you own your last name. All I have left to do is the, we added his name, and remember we clicked this to make sure that we have the director and the performer. We have YouTube, sponsor is TEDx, and then we have the date that was shown under there, and we're going to add an annotation. I'll show you a sample annotation that I might add. Okay, so in the annotation I see this interview, that indicates the research method that I've just used. And I wrote a little annotation and I create the citation. And there it is. Okay, do you see that? Okay.